Alright, what's good guys? I'm Big Brad Cloolin coming at you with a video showing you guys what sneakers I've purchased uh, in this month. I've seen a lot of other sneaker YouTubers do it and I thought, you know what? I may as well do it too because you're all part of the community now. They've pretty much accepted me, I think. So anyway, now that I'm a sneaker YouTuber by trait, let's get on to my haul from, uh, from the month or fuck shit. From the month. There we go. Probably... You know what, I should probably redo that so I can cut it properly. You know what, fuck it, I gotta piss. Now real quick, if you guys wanna give this video a big thumbs up, like I always ask, that would be very sick. Once again, your support guys, it's like, it's awesome. I really appreciate it, I love talking to you. I'm nothing without you, is what I'm trying to say. You guys are like the fucking, you, it's, like we're, it's like we have a relationship. We got a relationship without the sex. Probably not a good relationship then. Anyway, uh, by the way, in this video, you guys have seen a lot of these sneakers because I have unboxed them, but I haven't done like extreme details on them. And I said I'd do that for this video with the on feet. So anyway, first pair of sneakers, you saw me get ones that I'm not really fond of. I did get these drunk. If you guys didn't see the video, I, uh, I got really drunk one night, I went e shopping on eBay, which is always a bad idea, and I bought these. I bought them for like $50, so it's not too bad, and they're actually my size, surprisingly, so that's kind of dope, but I don't really like them, I was just drunk. But yeah, dude, up close on these ones, you guys will see an on feed of them at one point, I don't really know when I'll edit that in. Apparently these aren't Jordan 6s, I thought they were, but they're Jordan 6 rings. Or no, wait, no, they're Jordan rings 6, I don't fucking know. Here they are, $50 eBay. Not a huge fan, but they are really comfy, so I'll probably just work out in them. That's probably a bad idea. Maybe I'll play ball in them. Maybe I'll just ball his life in them. Next up for this month's kicks, we got this shit. I almost fell. We got the Tiempo 94s here. Now these, I said it in the video when I got them, but I've been wearing them lately, and these are the dopest fucking kicks I've ever had. These are so sick to me. Better than the Jordan 1s, in my opinion. Nobody will probably agree with that, but these are sick, man. I think I have, like, two or three more pairs coming in of the exact kind, just, like, different colorways. Anyway, Tiempo 94 kicks got these four. Or $45? $45, yeah, on eBay. They were lightly used, but I couldn't fucking tell, so they were a win in my opinion. Alright, man, here they are up close on the Tiempo 94s in the bread colorway. Very sick. We got the very dope, like, I'm gonna try to be very professional with this review. I'm gonna be like a regular sneaker reviewer. As you guys can see, we got the stuff. Shit. Uh, as you guys can see, we got the f the uh, leather right here. It's a very good one. I don't technically know the name of it, but it's a very good one. It's pretty spongy, so that means it's good. We got the uh, black right here. We got a red swoosh right here with the red hits of the with the red hits of the stitching. Very dope. We got the that white part. Then we got the Nike at the back right there, dude. Oh yeah. Also a really good hit right there is a swoosh. Very sick. All around though, on the real, very, very dope shoe. If you guys do like a style of the shoe, I highly recommend it. And a lot of the Tiempos do not come in all leather like this, but if you have a chance to pick up an all leather Tiempo, definitely do it. I think a lot of others are like suede or something, one of those materials. And I haven't gotten any yet, but if you guys have a chance to get a leather one, do it. Very high quality leather, very comfy as I put my hand in it. Like my hand's saying this shit's comfy right now, man. Anyway, dope shoe, recommended! Recommended, man. Just buy it. Fuck saving. Books are probably good. You should probably buy books. And then buy the shoes. But learning is good. Alright, next pickup. Boom, man. Next sneaker that we got up. Another third steal from eBay. The steal and deal for the third wheel. Pathetic. Bad rhyming. We got a... A uh, Nike Blazer here. Now, these are the Nike Blazer Brooklyns or some shit. They say Brooklyn on them, so I'll just guess what that's what they're called. But these, I never thought that I really liked, uh, the uh, shit. Nike, uh, fuck. Nike, pissing me off. Pissing me Nike, shh. Oh my god. I'm actually fucking mad now. Nike, fuck. Nike Blazers, thank god. I never actually thought that I liked Nike Blazers until I got these. I honestly just took a risk on these. I got these for $25, steal on eBay. They're apparently used, but they don't look it at all, honestly. Once you relace these, because they come kind of tight and like stupid looking, once you relace them to the way you like them, they actually have a really sick silhouette. Like, they look dope to me right now. But yeah, got these in a size, can't remember, because I go like three different sizes, because I can't make up my mind. We got these in a size 10. They do fit a little snug. I am a size 10 and a half, but they're still kind of chill. They still fit. If I need to take out the insole, I can. And I don't need to, so I don't know why I'm doing it. Oh yeah, there they are up close. We got the Nike, shh, fuck it. Nike Blazers. We got the Nike Blazers right here. Now the main part that I love 
about these is this fucking swoosh. So I got sick and I honestly didn't need to swear there. Like if this was a regular swoosh, I wouldn't really care. It'd be like a red shoe. It'd be like a red Converse with a swoosh and that's not dope. But Nike right here, we got the swoosh looking fly as fuck. We got more, we got that material. Don't really care what it is. And the bottom, once again, no dog shit yet because I haven't really worn them that much. But if you guys know me, I step in a lot of dog shit. So it, it's gonna, it's bound to happen. Anyway, there they are. Third kick. Also, real quick, this video is not going to have a lot of shoes in it, but that's just because I don't buy shoes that much. So three kicks in one month for me is kind of ridiculous. Like, I kind of have an obsession at this point is what that's saying. I think I got another one for you. But anyway, I don't really know where I'm going with that. Not too many shoes are going to be featured in this video is what I'm trying to say. Very dope. Perfect. Cut it off there. All right, guys. Last sneaker. Fuck off, chair. Last sneaker pickup for this month. We got the uh, Huff. Thrasher collaboration shoes right here. Now I got these, I think maybe a little over a month ago, but we won't say anything. Anyway, we got these here. Now, when I bought them online, these looked very sick. Like, I feel like they photographed shit. <laughs> they photographed extremely well. Like, these things are photogenic as fuck. But, when I got them in the mail, they're not that dope. Like, I'm not a huge fan of them. Anyway, we do have kind of like a Converse silhouette on these, which means it's a high shoe with this type of fucking feeling, like that fuzzy bear feeling. I don't know, man. I'm I'm not good at this. <laughs> this is what I'm trying to say though. These are pretty comfortable or so I don't know. But yeah, I got these for $75. Waste of money, bad money spent. I wish I could have it back, but I can't because these are in my hand and I've worn them and I regret wearing them because people made fun of me for it. They didn't. I thought that add to the story. It was just a lie though. All right, man, up close on these, we got the Thrasher logo right here, the only cool part of the shoe. We got some of this material here. Like if you guys have ever felt a very, very thin haired uh, teddy bear, that's what it feels like. Like a shaved teddy bear. Shave the fuck out of your sister's teddy bear and tell me it don't feel like that. It will. So that's what we have because I don't know what the material is called. Bottom, that. Don't really know why the bottom really matters, but it's that. But yeah, not too, too bad of a shoe. I'd honestly probably maybe rock them with these pants. I think that would be dope with maybe just a tank top, kind of like, kind of like a grungier look. Might look kind of chill, so we'll see. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow at work. Just make them think that I'm some sort of thug now. But yeah, man, that was the last. I'm gonna put my foot down. Uh, that was the last sneaker purchase for this video. Let me know what you guys want to see next. I'm just trying to make a lot of videos. I love this, like I keep saying. But yeah, uh, if you guys want to give this video a thumbs up, is what I'm trying to get at. Please do it. It really helps out the channel and it really shows me what you guys want to see. Also, if you guys do like the sneaker videos that I have been putting out, I know I'm not that informative of them. Like, I don't have a lot of information and I don't want to come off like I do. Like, if I don't know what the fuck I'm showing you guys, then I'm not going to pretend I know what the fuck I'm showing you. So, that's just what I'm trying to get at. I just like shoes. I know what I like and uh, I don't need to know much about them to show them off, I feel like. So, anyway, that's where I'm at. If you guys appreciate it. Sweet! We're on the same page. Fam, we're gonna tip now, because I think that'll be a cool outro. Fuck. Probably a little dangerous. One more time. Oh, fuck! <laughs>